one thing, everything is full of error if people don't have the will to correct errors. And one of the biggest errors ever made in the history of the known universe among the people of this planet was the idea and the concept and the practice of the system of white supremacy and or what we call racism. So whoever came up with that idea and and brought it to fruition in that form came up with the most powerful political and religious idea that is known in recorded history. That might be something back before what they have popular recorded history. But as far as the history that is available to the people on the planet right now, there's no idea, no concept of interaction between people, religious or politically, that is more powerful than the concept and the practice of the system of white supremacy and or racism. So oh, what, that, that's an error that should be corrected. It's an error. It never should have been. It never should have been established in the first place. We're in the universe. We should have universal people in the universe. That should be the classification of people in this universe. Universal people. Universal man. Universal woman. Very distinctive characteristics in both of them. And those characteristics should be spelled out based on what is the most productive what is the most constructive, productively constructive behavior in all areas of activity, economics, education, entertainment, labor, law, politics, religion, sex, and war. We don't have that. We don't have anybody on the planet that's qualified for that on account of this interruptive system called the system of racism, which is nothing but mistreating people based on color. It's the most powerful and and a very simple idea, most powerful idea for mistreating people and getting things done based on the mistreatment of people that has been recorded so far in history. Nothing has compared with it. No other system has compared with it. It's based on fundamentally the royalist system, but it's based on mistreatment of people based on color rather than kings and queens just saying that they can mistreat people simply because they're kings and queens. There's a cliche saying that goes back in some parts of history, the king can do no wrong. Anything that the king does because the king is the king is correct and righteous and should be followed and supported simply because the king is the king. That's the royalist concept in his purity. The king is holier than thou. But now somebody thought of putting kingship and queenship on a color basis, and that idea spread like wildfire. And the color was, or rather the non-color, some people might say, was white. And then the people who were considered to be people of color or people having color were considered non-white and if you were white you were royal if you were non-white you weren't and that all of the world's business should be done on that basis 24-7 everywhere at all times without exception and it was a powerful idea and it swept the entire planet and it's been in place right up to this very moment. And it never should have been in the first place because, according to logic and basic evidence, it's a better way of doing things. For instance, a better way would be a system of justice, which would be guaranteeing that no person is mistreated and guaranteeing that the person that needs help the most gets the most constructive help. Now, that's a concept, too that has never been seriously tried. It's been talked about. But it doesn't even have a definition, which is why I, uh, after asking people, what is the definition? And I was told, given all kinds of answers that were very unsatisfactory to me. So I made up one. And that was included in the Word Guide. Guaranteeing that no person is mistreated 
and guaranteeing that the person that needs help the most gets the most constructive help in all areas of activity, everywhere in the known universe. And that conceivably would be a product called justice. I don't, until somebody thinks of a better definition, I think that one will stand up. Particularly in lieu of, it's a compensatory definition, because I made it up, meaning compensatory meaning making up for what's missing, because I couldn't find a definition that made sense. And when I asked people, well, who determines what is justice? And they said, well, in this area of the world, whatever the Supreme Court says that it is, that was the answer from a person who was a lawyer. And then I said, oh, well, what is it worldwide? Well, question mark. So wherever there's a question mark, everybody should be searching for an answer that would make sense. So I tried to come up with an answer that would make sense by, after trial and error and whatnot, I came up with that definition, that compensatory definition that is included in the Word Guide. I think it will hold up until something better comes along. If something better comes along, then that should be the way to go. But we sure shouldn't have the system that we have in place now, and that's a system of racism as a way to run the world's business. The concept is that a system of justice would work much better. You can get things done with the system of racism, but it's designed to destroy people in the process of getting things done. Uh, it's, the evidence shows that in the system of white supremacy, racism, you can accomplish a lot of things if you just want to beat yourself on the chest and brag about accomplishing things. Having flying machines and machines that go to the bottom of the ocean and do all kinds of explorations and things like that. But it's designed to destroy millions of people in the process of being able to do these things. And people shouldn't be destroyed in the process of going to the bottom of the ocean or going in outer space or just getting through the day. It should be a better system. And conceivably, there can be a better system. Otherwise, if there can't be a better system, then you settle for a system of racism. But there's no strong evidence that the system of racism should have existed in the first place when there's conceivably, by concept and possibly by practice, there could be a better system. That better system should be seriously explored 